Good morning, everybody. It's the boss lady here coming to you from my vehicle. I'm not sure when you'll see this video. Maybe on the weekend. I don't know. Anyway, y'all, it's Thursday. Thankful Thursday. But your girl is tired. Oh, I'm so tired. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. So yesterday, of course, you know, I worked all day. I also had negotiations. I might slip in a clip or two of that in this video. Uh, so you probably see it's maybe Friday. But anyway, I had negotiations on on Thursday or on Wednesday, excuse me. Um, so that kind of you know it didn't go long. I mean, it was still part of my day. But then after that, I um, what did I do? I finished out my work day. And then I had to get off, make sure Boss Man and Miss Peanut had dinner. Once got their dinner, dropped her off, waited for Boss Man to roll up, say hello and goodbye. And then I had PTA meeting. Y'all, I was in traffic for over 30 minutes. And where the place was was not that far, but it was far enough. Oh my goodness. So that just... If I haven't ever said it, if I've never ever said it, I don't like traffic. I don't like traffic at all. And so just being in traffic like that just wore me down. Then a big storm came through while we were inside. Luckily, it happened while, once I got there. And a storm came through and you could just like see it rolling in and then it just downpoured. And then it rolled away and then the sun came out. And then once the sun came out, then a rainbow came. It was really kind of cool. Um, whew, it was our, um, end of year PTA celebration. It was really nice. We went to this place called, what's it? I don't even know if I still got the paper in here. No, oh, I don't. It was called The Market. And, um, it looked like some industrial warehouse building place. Cause I was just like, what kind of place is this? And then, um, once I got inside, I didn't record inside because there were so many people. It was located on the University of Minnesota campus. I had never heard of this place before, but why would I? Because I don't hang out at the campus. But anyway, you go inside and it's like um, there was different, different food vendors. So like, you know, there was one in where it was like burgers and fries and ice creams. And then there was like Asian food and barbecue and just all kinds of things. It was so cool. Um, I ended up having a barbecue brisket sandwich and Jojo fries. It was yummy-tastic. I didn't eat the bread, though. Um, I'm trying to not eat so heavy, and the fries was enough heaviness for me. The bread was, like, so much, but the brisket was really good. It had the uh, Kansas City flavor barbecue sauce. Really, really good. And once we got to the meeting... I realized all the moms outside of our president and our, well, our vice president, she does too, but she also has a senior, but all the moms outside of our president were all junior about to be senior moms. So that was kind of cool. So we were all kind of like connecting on that and, um, God, something's in my eye. Mm. When I tell you I'm tired. Oh my God, I'm tired. So the school, um, we donated t-shirts for the celebration. Um, and pretty much everybody who put their name in the hat got a shirt. So this is my one shirt. I mean, I have one of these already, but <laughs> yeah. So anyway, so I want another shirt, which I'm thankful for. Because I'm like, look, there might be a time where it might be polar blue every day. I'm just saying. Because I get tired trying to figure out what I'm going to wear to work. So, anyway. Um, but it was really nice. We were there. It was supposed to be from 5 to 7. We were there to like 7.30. It was nice, though. And then everybody kind of had different things. Like some, Oh, there was sushi there. I don't eat sushi. But one of the people that was there, he had sushi. Um, then someone else. They had empanadas. Um, they had this fried chicken. It was like an Asian fried chicken. Um, and then this one lady, I forgot what she had. She had something and she had kimchi. And I mean, it was like, and the portions are like, 
It's significant. The one thing that was cool about this place, when you check in, you check in with your debit card or your credit card. And so they put it onto what's called a market card. That way you can just go through the market. That way you're not constantly pulling it out. You know, you just go through the market with your market card. And then at the end, you can, you know, request a receipt to see what you paid and then turn in your market card. Because they give you back your, your debit card or whatever. They just put it on file. But that was really cool too. Oh, excuse me. Uh-uh-uh. But, um... Yeah, I really liked it. So stay tuned for little bits and clips, and I'll see you guys in a new video. Bye. Thank God for handicap. Make a U turn if possible, and then immediately Look at this. turn right. Please proceed to the highlighted route. This and then immediately this the place. Right. This the place. Child, you don't get off my nerve. Some old rickety looking. Mm, mm, mm. <sighs> Well, I made it. My God. All right. I'll tell y'all how it went. Bye. I'm back, y'all. <laughs> Leaving this place. Oh, my goodness. It's 725. It was over at 7, but we stayed a little longer. Oh, my God. Um, It was a different kind of a place. Because there were so many people, I really couldn't video in there. So, sorry about that. But... It um, it was like it had multiple different restaurants all in one place, and basically, you go in and um, you either give like a credit card or debit card, and then they give you what's called a market card. And on the market card, um, basically they put your 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 debit card or credit card on the market card. And you just you can go from place to place to place and buy stuff to eat. So it was really kind of cool. Um, I only went to one place. I kind of wish I would have went to the ice cream spot, but it was a little spendy. I'm not gonna lie, not gonna lie to you. It was a little spendy. Um, cause I spent thirty five dollars up in that mug. But I had a barbecue brisket sandwich. And it had cheese and pickles on it. It was a lot of bread, though, so I didn't eat the bread. And then, um, see, I know where I'm going now to go back. But anyway, I think. <laughs> um, yeah, I know where I'm going. I got that, and then I got a thing of Joe. Was it JoJo's or whatever? But like I said, I spent $35 because the sandwich itself was $16. The JoJo fries was seven, and then I got a lemonade. And the lemonade, the cup wasn't even that big. Child, the lemonade was four dollars and fifty cents. So it was all that plus tax, yeah. And they do a hot child. They get overhand over fist. Hospitality surcharge plus tax, yeah, thirty five fifty three. But it was fun. I hadn't been out in a while like that, and if it, it was um. What I liked about it, let me tell you, what I liked about it was, yes, it was the PTA, but there was nobody new there, and majority of the parents, or I should say moms, that were there were all junior, getting ready to be senior moms, so we were kind of all talking about that, which y'all know, that's my journey right now, so yeah, it was nice. You know, I was just talking with one mom. Her daughter just, um, her daughter was just diagnosed with autism just a couple months ago. And, you know, she was just like, I don't know what to do with that. And, you know, um, she was, I need an IEP for my daughter. And, you know, but I don't know what to do. So I was giving her, you know, tips and things of what to do and how to move forward. And, and then I was talking to another mom. We were talking about, you know, preparing for college. And then I talked to another mom and, you know, about, our kids um, having jobs and stuff but the last mom she more like family <laughs> she actually graduated with my brother-in-law and she knows my sister very well my big sister and um, you know we got more on a spiritual level um, I think she would like her son to date my daughter but my daughter is like no <laughs> Cause she's like, your daughter a good girl. And, yep, she gonna stay one too. Miss <laughs> Peter's like, mm-mm, 
I don't think so. <laughs> Miss Pina, uh, hilarious. <laughs> she a hot mess. <laughs> Because I asked her, I said, do you know? She was like, mm. <laughs> I'm laughing because before she went to prom, I was thinking of, you know, like, who who do I know who has a son that, you know, they decent and in order. But Miss Penn said, I'm fine with going by myself. I said, well, you know what? I ain't going to push you. <sighs> so, anyway. Um... But yeah, was, we were on a more spiritual level because we were we both work at schools, and um, you know we were just kind of swapping stories and stuff. But anyway, it was a good time, and all we did we didn't really have a meeting. I mean, it was like our end of year celebration, but um, we just had a good time. We um, I had brought uh, T-shirts from the school. Because we had some over overage of shirts, and so we did a raffle, and basically we had enough shirts plus some to go around. So I won another shirt, so <laughs> thankful for that. <laughs> Hello, because uh, look, you know, oh boy, my arthritis is kicking my tail; it's hurting. But anyway, so it was fun overall. But I do have pictures of my food, so you can see how big that bun was. Because that bun was something else. I didn't eat the bread. I took one bite of the bread and I was like, yeah, I'm good. Oh. I haven't had a lot of pain in a long time. I'm going to go see Doc on Saturday. Tell him I'm doing okay. But this pain is kicking my butt. Oh, y'all want to see a different McDonald's? Hold on. Y'all see it? It's right there. Well, on the University of Minnesota campus, so yeah, right there. <laughs> Pretty kind of cool. There's a Canes over here too, because when Miss Peanut had her birthday, she was like, "I want Canes for my birthday," and I'm like, "Where is there's a Canes close?" And so we came over here to the U. Uh, it's not on this corner where I'm at, but we parked up here, and then we had to walk. It was cold. I'll never forget that night. It was cold that night. So, anyway. So, the place that we went to, apparently, um, our PTA president and her husband go over there. I guess her husband had been introduced to it by some, like, previous co-workers. Uh, it's a nice little spot in the cut, I will say that. And, you know, depending on what day you go, you may not be bothered by a lot of people. Because, like, where we were sitting, we didn't have nobody bothering us. So, that was pretty cool. But, you know, I did fuss, though. I'm like, why you got me back off in the stick things? I'm like, where am I at? I'm talking about, you ain't never been here before? No! I don't kick it on the daggone university campus. Shoot. Lord have mercy. Child, it's a Snoop Dogg kind of day. <laughs> That's what was playing right now as I was turning on the camera. Oh, so... Uh, <laughs> I wasn't going to come back. I was just going to, you know, put in the info from the other video and call it a day. But y'all had to log in real quick to tell y'all this. So, my AP is out the building all day my principal is at a meet she's at she's got two different meetings over where i'm on my way to <laughs> so we had our round i call it our round table and uh at the round table someone else thought they was running the meeting i said oh no 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 uh -huh. i've been put in charge here so let me you know let me run it handle that next thing you know about an hour two hours go by and i'm hearing like all these like pitter patters of feet and chitter chatters of little voices i work at a high school not at a daycare baby i must what is going on these kids talking about something they was doing a prank supposedly they seniors you know and then had the nerve had the nerve the audacity to lie and say 
that the principal gave them permission, baby, when I got through, because I know she did not, and then I had to interrupt her meeting. Oh, yeah. Uh, she was none too pleased. None too pleased. I was like, are you kidding me? These kids will do the most and then get mad. So I had a kid cuss me out because uh, I told them, you got to go. Take your little brother with him, with you. Whatever he is to you, get out the building with the kid. Violations, violations. I'm like, are you serious? These kids, y'all, pray my strength through. Pray my strength through. Do you hear me? All right, let me go and do this finance stuff because I, ugh, I'm just wore out. I'm not going to be here that long. I'm going to be here all of, it was 117. I plan to leave at 2 o'clock. I'll be back. Hey, y'all, I'm back. Oh, wait, I was here all of 30 minutes. That is unheard of. Probably because I got my stuff together. I'm like, look, I need to know this stuff so I can. Oh, mm. My boss is still here. I thought she was heading back before I get back, and she is still here. Poor baby. Oh, yeah, that's her truck right there. Well, I'm heading back to um, hopefully uh, finish out my day on a positive note. It helps that the person I work with, she is a former secretary, number one, former secretary of, of our school, number two, and she's a parent of school. So it helps, you know, to be able to talk with her and get stuff done. Arthritis flared up. Flared up really bad. Jeez. I feel like I could just pull my thumbs off. But gonna let it stress me out I'm just gonna get on where i need to get on it's getting ready to storm yet again i'm about tired of these rainstorms that's coming through look everything's green we don't need no more water <laughs> even though some people oh we don't want to be having a drought child listen listen okay mm. so anyway so i'm heading back Ooh, these potholes or whatever these things are. Um, but yeah, I got to show you guys kind of little clips and stuff of yesterday going to the meet uh, to my PTA meeting. And then I'm supposed to have a PTA meeting on Monday. I'm going to have a PTA meeting on Monday, and then, but it's going to be here at the school with um, some of our school partners or whatever, so we shall see. But that's all I have for you at this point, y'all. I just wanted to chit-chat for a little bit, and um, yeah, I don't know what is going on. Mm. But I'm going to go on and get my peanut. I want to go see Bad Boys tomorrow. Because uh, Miss Peanut loves her some Will Smith. Don't come for my baby. She loves her some Will Smith. But. Mm -hmm. I actually got an invite. Back to the place I just went to yesterday. For a retirement gathering. But I don't think I'm going to go. I mean I'm not that close to that person. So. I wish them well. Yep. Ha, ha, ha.